Let's repot this little cakey. I'm reusing the typical orchid pot. Got this one nice and clean and ready for her. And she's going to need a lot of moss. It should be an easy transition. We don't need to pack the moss too tightly at this point. Here's where long fibers of sphagnum moss come in very handy. It'll help with the distribution of the moisture. Two key things I remind myself to look out for are 1. The base of the keiki or the crown does not come into contact with any moisture. 2. Be extra careful with this root. It's the only root. It's gone through a bit at this point. We don't need to overhandle it too much. There we go. I like to be able to see the root so I can keep tabs on it every so often. Orchids love to be stable. Let's add a little clip for her so she doesn't flop around. 